welcome to this month's healing circle. This month we're going to go through a, an exercise that's on my website called Cutting the Ties That Bind. It's an exercise that I recommend to anyone who is trying to let go of a relationship or let go of some negative energy, negative thoughts, negative people, um, to let go of addictions. It's really, you know, we have these energy centers that are known as chakras, and our energy centers create lines, pathways of um, communication between ourselves and others. And a relationship can emerge with anyone. Uh, it doesn't have to be with someone that you have known for years. It can be someone that you've met for a very brief time, a very brief moment. We set up these cords of communication with people that we are very fond of, that we love, and also with people that we dislike and who trigger emotions within us that need to be cleansed. And so these people are to be blessed, even though in a moment of anger or fear or dislike, we can't imagine why we would want to bless them. But these people are the ones who guide us and help us with our karma during this lifetime. So they are the ones that help us to get to know ourselves better. So this exercise is about releasing energy, releasing these cords, releasing that communication. So it's a little bit like putting the phone down. So that the next time you have a conversation, the next time you pick the phone up, it might be a different communication, a different conversation about a different topic, instead of the same old, same old energy going through. So what I'd like you to do is make yourself comfortable and then close your eyes. The reason you close your eyes is so that you don't have any outside stimuli. It just makes it easier. And meditation means to go into the center of your being. So that's what we want to do, go into our centers. So close your eyes. And I'd like you just to make the intention that you're going to relax, that you are relaxed, that in this moment you are completely and utterly at peace, relaxed, and you're letting go. Be in this present moment. Let go of any thoughts of the past, the present, the future. Just be in the now with my voice. I'd like you to take a few deep cleansing breaths. Again, just bringing yourself into your center with each breath. Breathing in. Breathing out. Coming into your center. You can imagine that you're coming into your heart. to release. 
imagine them in their entirety. Imagine them, imagine them sitting across from you at this moment. Those of you that are visualizing, imaging an addiction or a negative thought, then visualize this as a person or as light sitting across from you at this moment. And I'd like you to imagine that each of you is sitting in a circle of white light. White is the color of wholeness. White is the color of new beginnings, of cleansing. So each of you has your own circle of white light. I'd like you to imagine a figure eight surrounding these two circles of light and this figure eight is made of violet light. Violet is the color of transformation, of change. As you visualize this violet, it helps you to get to the real deepest part of your soul, the spiritual aspect of you. and white together help you to release relationships that really are not bonded to you. You are separate and yet one with everyone. On a love level. With love in your heart. So now you're sitting in a circle of white light violet surrounding you in a figure eight connecting you to this person sitting across from you. What I'd like you to do is just imagine that you have a cord, at least one cord of energy going from your body to the body of the person sitting across from you. And just get a sense of where that is coming from, where on your body it's coming from and where it's going to this person. You may have more than one cord. It could be like a road network going between you and this person sitting opposite to you. If you're not visual, just get a sense. If you don't get a sense, maybe you can hear where those cords go. Ask. Use your imagination. If you knew where would those codes cords go from and where would they go towards in this person. Good. Now you have a sense of where those chords go. Just be aware of them. And I'd like you to have a conversation with this person. I'd like you to tell this person of your gratitude, of how grateful you are for this person being in your life. Just be grateful. Say thank you. Mention how they have filled part of your life. Mention what benefits you have had because of this relationship. We're not focusing on the negative. We're coming from a place of love. one at a time, 
or you can cut them all together. Just use your imagination. Gold is the color of wisdom, of golden opportunities. Cut through those cords. And as you do this, bring the energy back to yourself. Seal the energy in your body. Wherever that cord comes back to, just seal it. And do the same for your friend. Do the same for the person opposite to you. Seal their energy as they take their energy back. See them sealing it. So that you are totally disconnected. You never totally disconnect. You're just changing the conversation. If there are any chords that at this moment doesn't feel right for you to disconnect, for you to release or cut, then leave these alone because this is your intuition that is telling you it's not the right time for these chords. Don't force it. Good. And once you've done this, I'd like you to imagine white light moving through you, just cleansing you, cleansing your energy just like a waterfall, like a shower of light, cleansing your energy. Do the same for your friend. Imagine them also inviting the white light in to cleanse them. Good. And finally, cut the figure eight in half, the violet. Cut the figure eight in half with the golden scissors so that each of you remain now in a complete circle of white in the center and violet on the outside. Completely formed, no longer a figure eight. Good. Take a deep breath in. As you breathe out, Allow yourself to release the energy. Good. And now the final step. I'd like you to wave goodbye to this person. Bless them. Wave goodbye. See them going off in their circle, off into the distance, out of your energy field. Until they are a, a blip on the horizon and then finally they just pop, they're gone. The energy is gone. You are completely cleansed. You are safe, protected. Your angels and guides are with you. And invite your angels and guides just to help you to heal at this moment. Because releasing in this way can just bring up some emotions for you your guides and angels to help you to heal over the coming days, weeks, months. You can take your time, stay in this meditation, and whenever you feel ready, just take a deep breath in. As you breathe out, open your eyes. And you can do this meditation at any time. But if you have someone or something that you are deeply connected to, then do this meditation every day for 21 days. So that you release 